So I walked out and I went to open the back door because I was like, oh, he's probably there. I open it. He's not there. And then I hear a knock at the front door. I was like, no fucking way. And it was his wife. And I was like, where the fuck is Jose? Like, I checked my phone and... What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Posted Podcast. He is the postman. We got Young Stunna, Brose, and your boy Lo. And the topic for the day is... <laughs> What's the topic? Back in SoCal, at my uncle's house. His house is, like, like really big. It has, like, a big backyard. It's like a rancho. So, like, we would go there, and then one day... I think, like, all my cousins slept over, but I never liked sleeping over because I found it scary. And they said that one day so. they woke up in the morning and they just saw, like, a lady in, like, a wedding dress walking around. Like, when they looked down the hallway in the middle of the night and then, like, they went to go ask, like, the parents, like, oh, what they, is that? They, they saw the lady in the wedding dress Like, in the walking house. down the hallway, yeah. And then, like, she would, like, she wouldn't face you. She'll be, like, anytime you would see her, she'll be walking the other way. Damn. And then there was one day where... Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is making hard. <laughs> so, like, as you're turning, she just, like, turns with you? Yeah, she, she's like... She got scared? <laughs> she's more it's scared It's basically, like, two hallways. Like, <laughs> left, you can see everything. That's all I thought about. But on the right side, you walk down a little bit, and then it's a sharp right. So, if you would look to your right, she's walking, and then she turns to the right and, like, gone. Yeah. Because one of my uncles went to check last time, and, like, he went to check, and there was nothing there. Which is crazy. Was that just like one time? No, it happens. Like people still see her to this day. Oh, so th- at this, the house, yeah, oh, at the same house. Crazy. house, same house, Roy's. Yeah, I'm not going over there. But it's just wild. <laughs> yeah, they said that's heard. not like the first time they've ever seen the same person like that. Yeah, which is crazy. Like imagine you just wake up in the morning and then you just see somebody in a white wedding dress walking down the hallway and it just disappear like that. Damn. You check your hand. You got a wedding ring. What the fuck? <laughs> Uh, I married yeah. Me. What's creepy to me is just the whole like you try to like peek there. Try to peek and she it just keeps moving. She, she's oh, scared, but leave it alone. She's out here just trapped in the house. <laughs> yeah, and it's it's like it's he has the hugest backyard. Like he has his like animals and all that it's there. Just hugest cheeks, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Would have been crazy. <laughs> I thought he was gonna say. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> his house is like super big. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't go out there at night. In, in SoCal, yeah. Like, this is crazy. It's like a really big house. The backyard's like creepy what if she's embarrassed she's like fuck they're gonna know i'm still here after this many years trying to figure out how to get out and like he used to take care of this house that was in front of his Mm -hmm. for like some people like an old house or just like not just a house that yeah he would like keep his cars there sometimes so it looks like somebody was living there yeah and then there was one day where my cousin got home with her boyfriend and they went to like check the house and they said everything was good and then they made sure everything was locked, and then they walk back out, and then they turn back, and all you see is just like two shadow things walking down, like past the window and the front window, because they would leave it open. Like from the outside. Like, yeah, from the out. Like they were looking. They're, well, they're, they're outside, outside but they're looking in to like make sure everything was off. And oh, and a light flicks on, and then you just see two shadows shadow. walking, but they didn't want to go back and check. Hey, so <laughs> y'all could stay. It's fine. And it was like, yeah. like, one a.m. when they saw it. I'm cool. Damn. Yeah, and it's crazy because like they made sure everything was locked, and then yeah. the light just flicked on and they just saw see, people. See, that's why we got such long lives, bro. Because Mexicans know better. We not finna turn around. And yeah, we ain't going in there. Let's go investigate what's going on. Yeah, I hated being home early from school, right? Because I'd be like the only one for like a while, like an hour and a half. I mean, yeah, it's cool. I get to play video games and all that, but. Pussy. Just like walking to the <laughs> fridge, like one headset off and one on. Yeah. I had, uh, I was grabbing water and like pouring it in a cup. And then I go to like crouch down and put the water back in. And like in my ear, all I hear is, hello, are you there? And I was like, what? oh, nah, bro. I put my headset back on and I ran to my grandma's house. What <laughs> did this happen? It was a while ago. It was when I was in middle school. Oh, I'm out here just sleeping with ghosts. You're not telling nobody. <laughs> <laughs> I said, fuck everyone else, yeah. bro. No, I told my mom and dad about it. Yeah. And they're like, oh, you probably just heard it from your headset. I was like, I had nothing playing at that time. Damn. Like, I, I wasn't just had them in because I didn't want no one to talk to me. Yeah. I said, obviously, I'm here, bitch. How did you see me? 
Was yeah. it uh, hello? What, what? Yeah, um, hello. But are you a, there? Like, but in are a you there? Voice? Yeah, like in a like, <laughs> it, no, hello, are you there? It sounded like in a raspy voice. Hello? Like, yeah. Are you there? I'm the Batman. I just busted, bro. Yeah, so I was like, fuck. Uh, hello. <laughs> but like, <laughs> <It's> crazy. <laughs> let, let, let him talk. You're there. I would think it was regular though, because like, even to like now, um, when I used to live in SoCal and I used to share the room with my brother, we would hear like cups be like slamming on the table or like being placed down. Yeah. Oh yeah, my mom's house. Yeah, and then I'd wake up the Fuck next day, that. ask my mom if she was like in the kitchen at that time. She's like, no, we're sleeping. And like, Damn. I would never go to the restroom at night unless I turned on all the lights and my flashlight to walk over there. Is, is this turn, true? This motherfucker turn all the lights on now. <laughs> I'm still turn them on at the house, That's what bro. I was going to ask until this day. You now. still do that at his house, right? Nah, it's just the hallway light now. Oh, okay. Because it's like bright now. Bro. But before I was turning on every light in that house, my room light, my flashlight, everything, bro. I'm yeah. not going to lie, bro. Recently, I did that for like a few days. It's like, <clears> it gets creepy. <clears> nah, because I, I was laying down. Yeah, recently. I don't know like why, but I just I got the urge to watch like all the Conjuring movies and like <laughs> yeah. the Annabelle movies and like all those movies from we that do, do quote ourselves. unquote like universe. Yeah. But I watched them in order. Oh nah, that's a mistake, bro. And so I'm watching them. I had just watched the nun. And I <clears throat> I was about to go shower and I had the light in the hallway on. I have my gaming chair in my room. I had put my shirt there that I was going to wear the next day because I usually get my clothes ready for the next day. Oh, yeah. Smart. You lay your clothes out? I put, I put my shirt. I had a white shirt and a black hoodie. But the way that I threw it onto like the chair, it just happened to look like a black like silhouette over the... Because the way that the chair shaped, it was black with like white underneath it. So it looked like the nun, like the nun outfit Damn. thing. Yeah. And so I looked at it and bro, I froze and I punch that light on so fast bruh and i looked and i was just like babe <laughs> hey. oh wait you have footage of this right no okay. that was a different time that was, okay. that was a different time for the other night but yeah for like the next three days bruh i had all the lights turned on whenever oh, i had to go to the bathroom bro. i was such a pussy bro it oh is my what it god is. y'all are soft i was not brave at all you know damn well you can have all these lights on today. No. We're not going to the bathroom at all tonight. <laughs> the other day I got, I think it was Saturday or Sunday, I got a little tipsy. And I offered to, to walk the dog out in the front. I scared the shit out of myself. It was dark. <laughs> <laughs> it was dark as shit outside. And I looked like probably like 10 houses down the street on the sidewalk. And you just see a guy come out. Or why my heart started pounding out of my chest, bro? Like he was chasing me. Because you live in EPA, bitch. That's <laughs> why. <laughs> That's it. A little too far. So I don't want Black Daniel. Okay. Oh, you're good. Okay. Um, I walked Paco. I was like four houses away from my house. And for some reason, I felt like I was hearing his footsteps behind me. So I kept turning around. I was scared. <laughs> <laughs> I was just not fucking about no, I didn't get to pee, bro. <laughs> oh, poor Paco, bro. We, we, we went inside, bro. I was like, I'm done. I'm Little sorry. Little Paco had to hold it till the morning, huh? Bro, I was yeah. terrified. I thought the guy was chasing me. Oh, nice. We do it to ourselves now. He did it to me, bro. You're just going to get mugged. I think well, I got home from somewhere. Like I just, I think I just barely got home and like Jose was coming like 20 minutes after or something. Was so I wasn't checking. I wasn't checking my phone or nothing. He was like coming? The, uh, pause, bro. <laughs> At all times. <laughs> I, I never, like, I don't check the ring camera that much when I'm, like, home. Yeah. And then I get up, and I'm like, he's supposed to be here by now. I was like, the dog isn't here, too. Because he went to go pick up Paco. Mm. And then all I hear is a bang on my win- like on my window, and it was him, oh, but yeah. I didn't want to check my window. So I walked out, and I went to open the back door because I was like, oh, he's probably there. I open it. He's not there. And then I hear a knock at the front door. I was like, no fucking way. And it was his wife, and I was like, where the fuck is Jose? Like, I checked my phone, and it showed that he got there. And then I go back to the door, and he was, like, hiding in the corner. Yeah. So I didn't see him at first. Oh, you were messing with him. I was messing yeah. With him. Oh, okay. He has big-ass <laughs> windows. I just try to, like, scare Yeah, bro. And I now always have my windows open or closed sometimes. Dude. Yeah. I hated. I hated his house, like, back then. Like, with the door there in the middle. Like, you can't see over. Yeah, it was pretty scary back then. So I would, I would have, like, the side of, like, the house and, like... I would never use my own restroom. I'd always go to his. Thank Shout you, everyone, for watching another episode of the Posted Podcast. Oh, wait, no. 
I didn't do the intro. He did the intro. Yeah, that's so fine. He, so he does the outro. Oh. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Dude, bitch. Bruh, I blocked the <laughs> mic. You can still hear what He's I'm still saying. still here, bruh. Yeah. Yeah, act like it's easy. Thank act like it's thank easy. Thank you for watching another episode of the Posted Podcast. All right, y'all. Thank you for watching another episode of the Posted Podcast. This is the Postman with Young Stunner, Brose, and your boy Low. Subscribe, like, comment, share. Let us know what other topic you want us to talk about. Peace. They don't be commenting. Well, we got a few comments now. Right. Gonna get in those. Peace words. out and stay posted. Stay posted, my friends. <laughs>